Oh, hi there. Don't mind me, I was just drinking some whiskey. Welcome to Chris's Tiny Kitchen. Now you may be asking yourself, Chris, why did you change the name? It was originally called Cooking with Chris, and we had such a good time with that name. I'll tell you something. Anyone who tried to look up those videos were doomed because there are oversaturation of Cooking with Chris's on YouTube that we had to do something about the name. Don't worry though. It's this new name, the same great taste. I hold here a new recipe. Now Matt Walker sent a recipe over here that I have no idea what it is. And lucky for me, I'm about to find out. So without further ado, let's check this one out, shall we? <laughs> oh, Matt Walker, you are such a d uh, So we are gonna be cooking crispy deep fried bacon. All right, so we're gonna start this off. We've got three eggs we're gonna need, so we're just gonna place them there. We're not gonna mess with anything on that one, okay? We need a half a cup of milk. Bacon! Flour. Just gonna, gonna grab some. LeBron James. LeBron James here, everyone. I didn't get that joke. What else do we need? Oh. Salt shaker, that's an egg, black pepper, and some oil for frying. Looks like we're gonna fry this. Bacon! One little egg. Ah, ah, ah. Who eggs? Ah, ah, ah. Calchocula? Why have you given me any calchocula? I really want some calchocula right now. No, what's that guy's name? The Count? Oh. From Sesame Street? Well, I know. I just thought it was count something. Three eggs! Oh. Oh, because he counts. So it's just count. Not count anything, not like count count. So, we need half a cup of milk. Well, the only thing I found was a fourth a cup, so we're gonna put two fourth a cups to make half a cup. It's science. Math. It's math, actually. Hashtag whisk it for the biscuit. Mmm. Bacon is the foundation for everything in life. When you're like me, or when you're like anyone else in life, bacon should be your number one priority. How do you open this package? So, we're gonna get a cutting board for this. This cutting board is blue. That's not the right one. What do you mean it's not the right one? What, what pan do we need? We need red? I didn't catch what that word was. I hate you so much, Christina! Stop bringing out the worst of me! So we need a red cutting board, correct? Where's the red one? So using these bacon slices, I'm gonna slice them in half. Yes, yes, slice in half. Vitality. I'm gonna put all these little mini slices in this little bowl. When you're cooking this kind of thing, you need thick sliced bacon. Why? I don't know, it's just, that's what the recipe says. Chris, I don't think the top slices are getting soaked whatsoever. So the recipe calls for them to soak for 30 minutes. So I'll see you back in 30 minutes. Another day, another shot of whiskey. Whiskey level has gone down, so. Oh well. <coughs> hey, hey, whiskey! I'm just gonna hold this face forever. Yeah, yeah. So we're gonna use three cups of flour. All right, we're good. Just kind of swirl it around. You kind of just wanna put your face in it, you know? Hello! I'm just gonna put salt in there. Pepper. Pour. That's good. All right, we're all lined up. What we're supposed to be doing is dipping them into our flour and then we're supposed to fry them. We're gonna use our vegetable oil and we're gonna put two cups into our pan. 
Oh yeah, I'm on fire. Watch out world. Chris is in town. And we're gonna wait for that to be ready for to dip some bacon in there. And we're gonna fry this some bitch up for you. You're gonna love this one. Here's what I'm thinking. You can always improvise on any recipe you will receive in your life. For instance, one shot for you and one shot for me. <coughs> yeah. Yeah. Heat up faster. Oh my god. Oh, Chris, there's a special request at this part by the Gear viewers. What viewers? They requested you do this next part topless. Are you serious? Yes. I'm not doing this topless. All right, I'm doing this topless. Let's do this. All right. Fry the bacon strips three to five slices. You really needed the recipe to fry bacon. We're gonna fry these for four minutes until they're crispy and gold brown, and we're gonna place them in a plate. See, this isn't so bad. Oh! oh Bacon are done. Can I put my shirt back on now? All right, all right, all right. Good job. Now our smoke alarm's going off. Shut up! Shut up! Oh, bacon, bacon. How was I supposed to know? So this piece of me right here to you, my bacon, all to you, fried. In, into oblivion is gonna be set into a cooking sheet and baked at 350 degrees. Can I get an amen? The hell? All right, now that the ancient oven has just told me that the food is done, we're gonna take it out of the oven. Here it is, crispy fried bacon strips. For those of you who are bacon lovers, this is what it's all about right here. This is the foundation of cooking right here. We're gonna wait. No, no, we're not gonna wait until it's dry. We're gonna eat this now. Oh god, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Fifty shades of gray, more like fifty shades of bacon. Oh. Oh. Thank you, Matt Walker, for the recipe. I'll be sending you something in the mail shortly. And for everyone else watching this, please submit your recipes to this website down below. Chris's Tiny Kitchen at gmail.com. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you on the next episode of Chris's Tiny Kitchen. Boom. Done. Goodbye. One large egg. Easy. One large egg. Eggs are in the fridge. One large egg. Shit.